My next guest is a two-time X Game gold medalist for women's motocross, and she's the first deaf person to ever compete professionally in the sport. She'll be going for her third gold medal in the upcoming X Games. Please welcome, along with her father, Jim, 21-year-old Ashley Fialik. Jim, you are here to interpret, is that correct? Yeah. Okay. Uh, first of all, welcome, Ashley. Thanks for being here. Thank you for inviting me here. Thank you. And I know that I'm very attractive. <laughs> yeah, definitely <laughs> handsome. There was a pause there. She was like, oh, okay, I'll be nice <laughs> to him. Uh, this is a fascinating story. First of all, your granddad and your dad grew up racing, and your dad got you started what age are we talking? Yeah, well, I started riding actually when I was three years old, and um, just um, I didn't start racing until seven, though, so um, I just love it. I rode with my dad and my grandpa. I just love it, so. But what's interesting is that you were riding a motor, you weren't riding a tricycle when you were three. You were riding a motorized bike uh, pretty young. Yeah, I never really actually rode a bicycle. I didn't learn how. I just always rode a motorcycle. <laughs> Well then, Jim, this question's for you. What the heck were you thinking? <laughs> yeah, you know, it's, it seemed like a good idea at the time. And uh, <laughs> we, I just grew up, my dad grew up riding, and, you know, we just thought when Ashley was born, we were going to get her a motorcycle and ride, and it just turned into all this. Yeah. Okay, uh, you're, you're, was there a harness? Was there any kind of seat belt? Was there any kind of, I mean, I, I can't imagine a three-year-old on a motorized bike. We actually have a picture here of you. This is a little older, but it's still the same gas-powered bicycle. Is that right? Which I'd be afraid to get on that. No, there's no, no special harness. I would hold on my dad's. I would hold the crossbar and just go through the woods. And my little PW, that little motorcycle, I would just ride. It had training wheels on it and it, it didn't work real good at first, but I still had fun on it. I didn't realize you could put training wheels on a motorized bike. <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah, they're, actually they were for a bicycle, but we put them on a motorcycle. <laughs> oh, well then that makes perfect sense. <laughs> 